Sure, my name is Juan Mario Gomez. I'm with Exact Metal, a startup company in State College, Pennsylvania. And we're here to introduce our latest product in 3D printing. Sure, what we've done is we have a metal 3D printing um, system that replaces traditional gavel servers that are used in these type of machines to do powder laser fuse, fusing of parts. And what we're trying to do is replace the gavel servers that are traditionally used there and use a different uh, scanning technology to bring the laser to to the part. Uh, by doing that, we're able to reduce the cost of the system, we're able to introduce a smaller footprint, and we're able to introduce features that increase the performance of the system without sacrificing the quality of the build. Our, our target is entry-level type uh, of metal printing, so we, uh, small labs, small research labs, prototyping labs, a really uh, target for this type of machine. We have a build area of five by five by five inches, so it's really for a lab that's trying to do development of parts, a small university, a medium-sized university with multiple labs. We're really trying to reduce the acquisition costs of the system without sacrificing performance. We've designed the system to be able to do both reactive and non-reactive uh, powders. Um, initially, we're starting with non-reactive powders, so both uh, stainless steel and Inconel, or 718. Uh, in the future, we'll have aluminum and titanium. Uh, by the end of the year, most likely, we'll have those going on. Uh, we also have a very attractive pro uh, powder pricing strategy. We believe that customers should want to print parts and not have to have a big bankroll to do so. So we have a very attractive powder price without any, without any limitations that allow our customers to really start printing parts. The machine is 120,000, uh, which is a great entry level for a five by five by five uh, cubic inch uh, volume. Um, typical machines of this would be more than uh, 200,000 or so in price. We're pricing the machine at this level because we'd be able to do so with changing the technology, but also to attract people to start using these type of machines in, in, in metal printing. We came here thinking that a couple of people would be interested, and we've had uh, the media, we've had customers, we've had competitors. Really a great, great reaction to the system, uh, telling us that we're doing the right things, telling us that they like our machine. It's just absolutely fantastic.